Well, if you're watching this video, you've either bought one of the new Huawei phones that doesn't have the Google Play Store or you're thinking of getting one. And they've got some great models. And I love the Huawei phones because they've got some of the best cameras out in the marketplace right now. So we're looking at uh, a few models here that uh, have the new Huawei app gallery. They don't have Google Play Store built into it. This is the uh, Huawei Mate 30 Pro and the new granddaddy here, the Huawei P40 Pro, and uh, again, an amazing phone. They make it easy to move from your existing iOS or Android device. Their phone clone app is one of the better ones out there. So the uh, Huawei App Gallery, like I said, has thousands of different uh, apps here. Look at that, it's got Microsoft Office 365. They've got the different categories here as well, everything from games to business, health and fitness uh, as well. You name it, uh, there's an app for that. But not everything is here, including apps from Google's Play Store. So. If your app isn't in the Huawei gallery, don't worry, we can still find it. What we're showing you next is not endorsed by Huawei or Google. It may introduce some additional security risks as well. If you're okay with that, then continue on. And what you wanna do is just go up to search and type in more apps, more apps. So we just click on that and install it. And this is basically kind of a, a search area to find what I might happen to be missing. I'm going to allow it to know where I am. Do, do, do allow while I'm using. Disclaimer. Look at that. And here is a list of all the popular apps that you probably want to get a hold of. So remember we couldn't get Netflix. I'm going to click on that. And here's some sources where you can get it from. You can get a web version or you can go to this APK Pure, and this is something that you'll also want to install. Once that's installed, this is super, super easy. So I'm gonna click on that. It's going to ask me, do I want to install APK Pure to download instantly into these apps and games? Yes, and once you do this, you only have to do it once. Hit install. It's gonna take you to the website, and it's gonna ask me down at the bottom, do I want to download this? Yes and it downloads actually pretty quick. And I'm just gonna hit, you can see down on the bottom here, I'm gonna hit open. And presto kazinga. It's going through, installing it through Chrome. No risks detected. I'm gonna give it all permissions. Just have a look here again. Just make sure you're comfortable with all of that. And hit install. Presto kazinga. So now I can open that. I'm gonna give it some of the permissions here to access various parts of my phone. And I'm gonna go back out to the more apps here. So that's installed now. That's gonna make this all super easy. So I can click on more apps. And remember the Netflix there? I can basically hit APK Pure again. And this time it'll pop up, hit install. And here it goes. It's asking me for permissions again. I have to allow it to install apps. And down at the bottom, just hit install. Hey, here's Spotify. Let's check that out. I can basically hit install once again. Down at the bottom here, install. And presto kazinga, they're there. So Netflix, let's open that up. Check that out. That seems to be working. And we can try Spotify. That seems to be working as well. Make sure you remember to go back and uncheck this option in settings after you're done. This secures your device and prevents malicious apps from being installed without your permission. So in conclusion, if you can't find your favorite apps off of your old phone, if they're not in the Huawei app gallery, you can find them through more apps. And remember, it's kind of a two-step process. You do have to find more apps by searching for it in the Huawei app gallery. Once that's installed, another app that you'll need is APK Pure. And uh, you'll pretty well be able to find anything you want once that's installed. I go back into more apps here, and again, I can find all the favorite apps that you might be missing, and it's pretty simple to get up and going. 
And the nice thing now is that I'm running my Huawei P40 Pro. It's running uh, the stock Android 10 operating system. I can get all the optimized apps in the Huawei App Gallery. And if I'm missing anything, I can go into more apps. Pretty simple.